steel. Fighting out of the Timberwolves corner, standing five feet, six inches tall, he weighed in 170 pounds. Training out of the Iron Range Wolfpack, and sponsored by Stand Up Fight Gear. Hailing from Hibbing, Minnesota, this is Cat Mean Bean and the Jeremy Anderson, the much more accomplished wrestler. He was a national champion at Augsburg. Cat Romero, I believe, was a state champion, though, and a JUCO champion. This is going to be a good fight. Cat Romero's definitely got size on him. A lot of size. But uh, I was watching Jeremy warm up on the pads. He looked crisp there, too. I mean, these are two well-rounded guys. They're, they're close to undefeated. They've had a lot of fights, a lot of experience. This, this is definitely worthy of being a main event. This is a really good fight. Jeremy Anderson has Joe Lynch and uh, Dave Manet in his corner. That's a solid corner right there. And it's on. Touch of gloves to start things off. A little jab from Jeremy. And a nice little leg kick. He's kind of feeling him out here. And he eats a big punch. Chat wasn't about feeling anything out. Jeremy come out kind of relaxed, you know, wanting to feel it out. And Chat just blasted him. <laughs> Got the over under clinch there, kind of working for pummel. And a nice knee. Real good reversal now. He's going to look to get him to the ground. Tat looks incredibly strong. And he's going to pick him up and take him out. He's, he's got a butterfly hook in, but it's, it's kind of an awkward position. Switches to butterfly guard. Butterfly guard with one underhook. Um, but he's up against the cage, which is really going to nullify pretty much every option he has other than just stand up. Yeah, it looks like Tat's looking to pass now. Huh? He pushes him off. Oh, but Tat really advanced position on that. I mean, he's got half mount right now, I and mean, there's a butterfly hook in, but he's working. He's back to butterfly guard. He must really like this butterfly guard. He, I, he must be wanting to sweep Tat because, I mean, the butterfly guard isn't, is all right for setting up submissions, but, I mean, for the most part, it's, it's a sweeping tool. Yeah. He'd be better off if he just wrapped full guard and... Tried working from there and keep that guard closed because Tat's thinking to pass, you know. Tat's coming up to punch now. Ooh. Big punches. Big punches, big punches. Ooh. Oh, he's coming down. He's swinging that triangle right off. Though. Let Tat just walk right through and that. Just, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, big that elbow. Cool elbow. That, that don't feel too good. No. That, I mean, that was... It's got a solid... That was uh, nice. I was just having the with it all to throw that elbow from that position was kind of cool. Tat appears to have the... The weight and strength on him. Big punch. Yeah. Oh, but Jeremy, Jeremy gets up. Going for old school. Play. Oh! That, that could have done damage to Tat if he would have eaten that. And he's on his feet. Throws that leg kick again. Both fighters back up. Tat needs to keep their hands up. Tat's and waiting. He's been praying on that right hand. As soon as that leg kick comes in, he's getting ready to fire it. You can tell. Yeah, he should have it up a little higher, though. 
Both fighters circling. Jeremy's got to put more power into his strikes. Yeah, Jeremy's kind of stepping in and stepping out. You know, he's got to oh, he's got to I mean, make those make each punch count. You know, oh, just sprawls. Out on yeah, that was a good sprawl from Tat. Yeah, that was. It was. Let's see if he's gonna try to ride him over, or if he's gonna take the back. Jeremy's got to try to pummel in and get a leg and drive or do something from here. Doesn't want to sit here. Tat could set up a a choke. It looks like he's trying to ride him though from the. Oh. Tat could really sink in uh, Anaconda choke. How the way Jeremy's arm is. Shot to the left one there. To go, one He's coming around. To go. And he grabs the double. Yep. And Jeremy gets now the Jeremy's sprawl. Now Jeremy's on the sprawl. Great this is fight. exactly the fight I wanted to see, man. This yeah. is great. Jeremy's, Jeremy's going for the, the sit through. He's trying to trying to get the Puerto Rican necktie. I oh. have that. Uh oh, Tad's in trouble. Oh man, that's deep. He's right in front of his corner. He's gonna try and sit up now. Oh, there he's, we out. Go. he's out. He's out. And he's back getting hammer fisted hammer now fist. from that single position. That choke, I think that choke scared Tad a little bit. I think it he did. knows now he can't he can't waste any time with Jeremy. Yeah. Jeremy's Jeremy's gonna attack him. I think this round's almost over and they're gonna probably go to a second round here. Very good fight. A lot of technique, a lot of wrestling. You know, both this this is a main event fight right here. And he gets swept. Now he's on the bottom. Ten seconds left. Such Jeremy. a back and forth fight. I really, yeah. I don't even know who to give it to. Jeremy's looking really calm though. You know, he's keeping his composure. Back there. to his front fly guard. Good job. Good job. Good fight though, both guys. Here we go, round two. Jeremy leading with that jab. Tat, both guys taking center of the cage here. There's that leg kick again. Yep. It's it's he's not putting everything there. Oh, nice head kick. Big head kick. Tat should throw that left hook again, you know, is is the work there, there he goes. He threw it. You know, it's it's landing sometimes. He's starting to get worried about Jeremy's striking though. Yeah. Another head kick. Jeremy's getting real comfortable here. Yep. Jeremy's taking him on the feet, you know. He, he's gotta try to finish with these strikes though. He's just peppering him. Yeah. Tat's throwing just ones and, and one he gets twos. a nice sprawl in there. Beating through for that front headlock. Yeah, you should really he, try to put on that. Looking for the knee. Back to the feet we go. Another head kick. Damn. He's landing those too. And he just put his hip through. I mean, he'd be doing some serious damage. But right now, they're, it doesn't look like they're having much of an effect. Yeah, he's still landing them though, you know. And Tat's going to feel those. You know, but it's not enough to finish him. Not only that, but the judges are going to see those. You know, those are cool things. And judges love flashy objects. Yeah. So. Oh, big, big hook. Big exchanges there. Both fighters. Tat really needs to let some leather go. Jeremy's just picking him apart. He can finish it. Tat's such a big guy. Yeah. I wonder if the wow. weight cut is getting to him because he seems a lot slower. Now. Seems a little drained. He's looking for. Uh oh. Jeremy looks like he's got a uh, Kimura from a half Kimura. guard there. Tat needs a. I think he needs a pass off all the way to the left. And he gets oh, swept no. with it. Nice work with Jeremy. He's out. He's out. Jeremy takes the hat guard position from top, but uh, his posture is being controlled pretty well by Tat. Tat's got double underhooks on there too. Yeah, but try to squeeze off the He's back. only got half guard and it's it's a pretty, Jeremy's pretty high up on that half guard. I think he could pass here. No real work here from the bottom yet. Tat's really hanging on. I think he's hoping uh, the ref will maybe stand him up. But uh, Jeremy's got to be happy in his position. Though. Tat coming into this fight with a lot of momentum, too. I mean, he's, he's won a lot of fights in a row. Both of these guys are, are very experienced. Yeah. Tat's really got to try to, you know, Jeremy's got his right leg so high he can't re-guard, you know, the full guard. There we big go. Big elbows. Jeremy hitting big elbows. Ooh. Wow. Tat's mounted now. Full mouth. Jeremy's got to push down on his face. And He's got a real high out. mount too. Well, there's there's still not much on yeah, those. these punches on his elbows are coming through though. Yeah. Putting a little power there. He locks the cage, looking to turn him over. Oh, he's, he's pinned on his side now. This this is a lot of trouble for Tad. Yeah. This is Tad's probably Jeremy's best place to be right now in this fight. 
digging it hard for that choke. He's yeah. really trying to grind that in there. These punches aren't doing anything. They're baby, they're just taps, you know. He's better off. But Ted's got to do something. He's got to look like he's fighting back, and they've stopped it for less. Is he out? He's not moving. I think he's just incredibly gassed. The ref, I think the ref's going to look to call it soon here. I mean, he's patty caking on his head, but, I mean, Tad is doing absolutely nothing here. Yeah. They, they throw in the towel. I mean, they, I, it's just throw in the towel. He's not doing yeah, it. Yeah, I think Tad might be out. One minute to go, one minute to go. Jeremy should really start flurrying hard here. I mean, this, I mean, he's got the fight won, you know. Yeah. No, Tat's not out. I, I got worried for a second. He's still got the back there. Yeah. And flattens him out again. Tat, and there's, there's the tap. tap. He got the choke. Congratulations, Jeremy. That was his biggest fight of his career right there. Huge. A lot of people, a lot of people were saying Tat was gonna win this fight. I had a guy say he'd give me 30 bucks and then Jeremy was able to finish it. And there he goes. You know, I mean that's he had great training, great technique in that fight, and I mean he played the butterfly guard well, his stand-up looked crisp, you know, and he just he wore the big man out. I mean that's a that's a great fight for Jeremy. Yeah, both guys put on a great performance. Your winner at four minutes, twenty-one seconds in the second round. Tap out, do a rear naked choke. This is Jeremy, the Secret Psycho!